I have a mission. We're going to invade the worlds of other players, late at night of course, and see what chaos transpires. However, this time I decided to play some games with whatever players were unlucky enough to allow me into their worlds. <laughs> hey, don't get the Shogun wet. What did I just tell you? Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce you to our new friend Hok Hokmu Hok Hokmut Hokmut Hokmu. We are going to start with a very basic question. What would you do if I told you to follow me? It'd follow you. We are off to a fantastic start. Follow me. So now that we have this person following me, I suppose I should let you know what my plan is. Are they following me? Nope, okay, yep, alright, let's keep going. So the plan is either we could try to lead them around the map for as long as we possibly can, or we can pick a specific destination. I am definitely enjoying this way too much. I just love the fact that they are following me blindly and they don't even know where I'm taking them. You absolute fool. Hurry up, my minion. Don't fall behind now. Now there's just one small little issue with what I'm doing right now, and it's just the fact that I cannot find my way out of Storm Terror's Slayer. Now that I have run us into a dead end, I can't let this person know I actually don't know where I'm going, so I suppose we're just going to climb up here and hope we can get towards the entrance this way? Hey, no, you, 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 stop, you're not allowed to shoot me, I'm trying to climb over here. Hey, I said you can't shoot me. Alright, you know what, yeah, we're just gonna take care of him. I took the liberties of putting a pit on the map, so now I actually know what direction I should be going in. Hey, I found my way out. I probably shouldn't be that proud about that. You know, since they're playing as D-Luke right now, I think it would be fitting if we tried to get them to follow us to the winery. I may have forgotten how close the winery actually was to Storm Terror's lair. New plan, the winery is just one stop on our journey. And there we go. Nice weather we're having. And while we're here, let's mark our actual destination for this trip. We want to go to the top of Dragon Spire, like the absolute top, the floating thing in the sky. Well, as nice as it is to just sit here, I think it's time we get going. After all, we do have quite the mountain of a task ahead of us. All right, I know I said I would stop with the terrible jokes after that butter one last time, but it's the last one, I promise. I suppose that I should confess, I do not remember whatsoever how to actually get up to Dragon Spire without teleporting. Though I suppose the easiest approach is to just keep going up. Oh, I see it. That's where we're going. Due to a lack of heat sources along the side of this mountain, we are going to actually be using Kokomi. Our friend decided to take a little detour to go to a heat source, but we are finally being reunited again. Seriously, why are they still following me? Well, we have made it to the final ascent to get to the actual spire of Dragon Spire. I have to admit I am pretty amazed that they have followed me all the way here because if someone told me to follow them into the Dragon Spire area, I don't know that I would. We have officially brought this man, or woman, all the way from Storm Terror's lair to the highest point on the map, or at least I think it's the highest point, but being that we are all the way here now, there's really only one thing left to do. What goes up? I think for the next person, I want to try to get them to the top of Wing Shu Inn. Hello there, next person. It would appear that they like to play instruments, so allow me to play them some classical music. So what are you up to? Idik, honestly, I'm just exploring hyphen. I'll tag along if there's somewhere you wanted to go. You know, it really pains me when a lot of players leave chests out in the open like this that are so easy to get, and then they just, they, they don't even realize it. Please come and get this chest. Yep, there you go. Now open it. There, very nice. I'll go wherever you want since Idik where to go, lol. If you insist, it's time to head on over to Wang Shu Inn. Now what do you think is going through their head right now? Certainly it's not the fact that this random player that entered their world is going to lead them to the top of a hotel perched in a tree for absolutely no reason whatsoever. Because I mean, who would actually do that? Oh wait, I would. Our target has been acquired. Hey, at least we found them another chest on the way over here so it's not a complete waste for them. Why aren't they getting the chest? 
Excuse me. Open this chest. Can they not see it? Why aren't they opening the chest? Open the chest. Why would you not want to open the chest? It's free loot. Thank you. Jeez. Let us tomato. No. Let us begin our ascent. I'm happy to report that they followed me all the way to the top of Wingshu Inn, and we got the Majaculus along the way. What a view. I see why Xiao likes it here. Very pretty here. Shall we go do your dailies? Oh, let me see what I have to do, hyphen. Well, while they're looking at what they have to do, I'm just gonna start heading over. Let's just take a moment to appreciate how amazing this game looks. Oh, hyphen. It says I have to visit Storm Terror's statue, hyphen. Ah, uh, jeez. All right, they're almost over here. What is taking them so long? They were just here. Where'd they go? Wait, they were just here like two seconds ago. What? What? Why? Oh, yeah, all right. I, I guess they want to do the other one first. To save you all time, the other daily commissions seemed to be glitched because they couldn't see the person they were supposed to talk to, and we spent about 20 minutes trying to figure it out. Again, with this, really? There's a, there's a chest right here, and they're just gonna ignore it. That's completely fine. I'm, I'm completely fine with that. There's also a chest to your left. And yes, ick, I just don't want to claim the chest. Why not? It ick actually probs just lazy me hyphen. What? I had to vacate that last world because my blood pressure was gonna spike, but now we are here with mushroom less than three. This, this right here is my favorite kind of co-op experience. When you just randomly run around doing pretty much nothing. What's your name? Shade. That's so cool. Shade. I like the ta name. Thanks, smiley face. Let's go do something fun. Let's. What do you want to do? Something fun. Yeah. Yes. Like fighting bosses. Or bosses will be fought. Or well, here's a new one. This person actually invited me into their teapot. I haven't even been in my own teapot since it was first given to me. So I'm going to leave this up to you guys to let me know if this is a good teapot or not, because I really can't say. Yo, they got cloud retainer in their teapot. Okay, uh, well, hold up. Hold What is this? What? What is this that I see? Excuse me? I think their dog is broken. Yeah, I think I've been in this teapot for long enough. It's time we move on. I have devised a little game that we can play with this person. So let's just quickly say hello, and then we'll see if they're up for a little bit of fun. Is there anything I can help you with? I have a riddle for you. Ooh, okay. The way it will work is as such. I will state the riddle. Then you will go to where you think I am hinting to. Once we are there, or kill the boss, or do whatever it is at that location, I will tell you if you were correct. For all of you watching on YouTube, I'm not going to tell you what boss it is that I want them to find, and we'll see if you can figure it out first. Okay, that sounds easy enough. Your first clue is... Fierce Owl. Oh, it seems like they have made a guess, so we're gonna head over there and we'll find out if that's the correct answer. One Thunder Manifestation boss fight later? Did I get it right? This was not the correct answer. I shall provide another clue. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards. Walk, expect resistance. Let's see if that helps them at all. I believe they have made their second guess now, so let's see where they've gone. Oh, looks like they've headed over to Oceanid. All right, let's find out if that's the right answer. Oceanid is down, and now I can reveal whether they were correct or not. This was not the correct answer. I kind of had a feeling it might not be. I will advise you to take a close look at the letters used in the first clue and compare them to that of the second. I'll retype the first clue so perhaps it becomes a little more obvious. Fierce Owl. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards. Walk. Expect resistance. Since when are there owls? Mind not the literal meaning of words. Instead, cast your gaze upon the construct of this sentence. You must capitalize upon this opportunity. I am having way too much fun with this. Is there a tap out button for idiots? Hmm. Do you see the letters used in the first hint? 
Fierce Owl. They also appear in the second. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards, walk, expect resistance. Oh, so a word scramble. Though the second clue capitalizes upon the chance to spell it out for you. They appear to have made yet another guess, so let's head on over. One frosty flower fight later, we're gonna collect this loot and then let them know if they were correct. This was the correct answer. Thank you for playing. Little did I know that this person would be the one to figure it out the quickest. It only went downhill from here. And it went downhill fast. Oh, would you look at that? We found A. I guess she finally decided to come out of the plane of Euthymia. Hello. Hi. Doing dailies? Yes, and some bounty. After your dailies, I have a quest of my own for you, if you choose to accept. Sure, I can help you. A couple of commissions later. So I have a riddle for you. The way it will work is I will provide you a hint, and then you shall go to wherever you think it is that I'm referring to. Oh. After we get there, or kill the boss if there's one, I will tell you if you were core correct. Would you like the first hint? Yes. The first hint is Fierce Owl. Owl? Hmm. Uh, um, Fierce Owl. Let me think. Well, it looks like we're gonna be fighting Ocean it again. Ooh. If that rolls crit rate, that could be good on a broken set. This was not the correct answer. Colon apostrophe capital D. Would you like the second hint? Okay. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards. Walk, expect resistance. Uh, colon apostrophe parenthesis. I would capitalize upon this opportunity if I were you. Oh, they got it. They understand. It's so hard hyphen. Oh, I thought they got it. We then went on to fight the puppet and I'm not going to show everything because it was well over an hour of them trying to figure this out. So I'm just going to speed through the exchange of text that we had. This was not the correct answer either. I would rank Dainsleaf lower than other characters because he's so cold. Eh? Hyphen. The Cheatster. Uh... Allow me to rewrite the hints and alter the first slightly. Fierce Owl. Okay. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards. Walk. Expect resistance. I advise you to capitalize upon this opportunity, plus the Dainsleaf one. Kaya? Traveler? Colon apostrophe parenthesis? Geofather? Hmm. I advise you to capitalize upon this opportunity, colon apostrophe parenthesis. Fierce Owl. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards. Walk. Expect resistance. Characters in Genshin? I mean, the hint is character, colon apostrophe parenthesis. I used Dainsleaf's name as a hint, but the answer is a boss. Boss? Hyphen? Unknown god? Hyphen? I'm bad at this. We're able to fight this boss. Unknown god? We can't fight her. X capital D. What do these two hints have in common? Fierce owl. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards. Walk. Expect resistance. The new boss in 2.3? I advise you to capitalize upon this opportunity. Capitalize? I have no idea to think hyphen. So, you see the letters in Fierce Owl. No hyphen. You... Uh... Ha... Huh? Fierce Owl. You see this. L? Both words. Oh. Don't focus on the words themselves, but rather the letters. You notice what they all have in common. Common? Yes? Yes. Ugh. I advise you to capitalize upon this opportunity. Fierce Owl, but Owl is howling in night? Let's focus on the second hint then, X capital D. It's certainly easy. First, look onwards, walk, expect resistance. Don't focus on the whole picture. Rather, just focus on the very beginning. Sometimes the beginning of everything is more important than what follows. Beginning of the game? Uh, 
Did I mention that you should capitalize upon this opportunity? Unknown God in the Abyss Order? I have no idea, colon apostrophe parenthesis. I would rank Dainsley flower than other characters. He is an nice, uh, lunim or aether? <sighs> Have you ever seen a river flower? Actually, maybe not. It's a pretty nice scene though. River? Hmm. Uh, nope. What kind of river? Sometime people cry over things that make them happy. Like if someone close to them gives them flowers. Colon apostrophe parenthesis. My god, I have no idea and I have poor memory hyphen. Would you cry over flowers? Cry over flowers? Yes. This answer is a boss, don't forget. Uh, I have no answer hyphen. I can't put it any more nicely for you. You know Reggie? My friends call him Reg, but he's a vine. As they say, Reg is vine after all. Reg is vine. Yes, he is. And then? Somebody please help me. I literally cannot make this any more simple than I already have. Sometimes Reg will cry over random things. Reg is Vine and he does cry over random stuff. What a strange man. Cryo? Hmm. Don't forget about Reg. Cryo Reg is Vine. Let's fight it and find out. Ha 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 ha. After that, I need to log out. Hello everybody, it is future me here editing this video together. I just wanted to make it very clear that I'm not trying to make fun of anybody that I encountered during the video. I enjoyed playing with all of them and was genuinely laughing during most. The last person did struggle to solve the riddle, but it ended up being a really funny interaction. This one took an entire four days to record and edit, though the recording part took two days since I could obviously only record it late at night. I know it was a bit longer than most of my videos, but it was originally 45 minutes and I cut it down to what it is now. So I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, then all I ask is you click that little thumbs up button below the video. Trust me, it does help a lot. See you guys next time.